Hello everyone, Dead Poodles here, and today I have the first episode of my new Destiny 2 Tips and Tricks series, where I show you some helpful hints and tips, starting off with the very basic stuff for anyone new to the game, and moving into more advanced tips and tricks as the series progresses. New videos drop daily, so be sure to subscribe to stay up to date. And with all that out of the way, let's get right into the first tip. So starting off, here is the answer to a question I get very often, and that is how to raise your power level up beyond 300. It tends to get a little hard after you hit 270, but every week, the milestones reset, and completing these quests and turning them in always yields high-powered items. If you're curious to figure out where your milestones are located, open the director menu, that is the map, and pull the left trigger on Xbox One. I do believe it would be the left L2. L2 on PlayStation. It's been a while since I played PlayStation. Ah. But when you complete these and turn them in, you will always get an item that is guaranteed to be high powered. See, I just got the living memory there, and that's now able to boost up my crimson to 335. Doing this every week will raise your power quickly, even more so if you're using three of coins, which I didn't have, but if you do have them, putting them up before you turn the milestone in will almost guarantee you an exotic item. Another tip that is extremely basic, but I see so many people disregarding, is stick with your team. Even if you're in quick play with a completely random team, you're always going to do better if you stick together. Even if your teammates aren't exactly working with you, you're still going to be team shotting people, killing more enemies, going on better streaks, winning more games, and having a better time. Only five minutes quick left. play and competitive mayhem, maybe not so much, it's a little easier to run solo, but definitely always stick with your teammates. That is the key to winning. That's how I have such a good win-loss ratio. My kill death isn't as good, but my win-loss ratio is really, really good. The last tip for the night, go heroic. When grinding out public events, it can take a while. So turning the event into a heroic event is always the best way to go. Each public event has a specific task that you have to accomplish while in the event to turn it heroic. For the Cabal Digger, it's shooting down the spaceship, but it varies from event to event. For some reason, when turning in milestones, I always tend to get the best gear from the Flashpoint milestone. Not sure why. That's gonna do it for this one. If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to drop a like. Always much appreciated. New Destiny 2 tips and tricks drop every Tuesday, so subscribe to stay up to date. Follow me on Twitter at DPS United for more news and game-related content. Get your grip on with Vague Grips. Check them out today and get 15% off your order with offer code POODLES. New Destiny 2 build drops this weekend, so be sure to slam that notification bell so you know the minute new videos come out. As always, this is Dead Poodles, and I will talk to you all next time.